Hello guys, welcome to Createc. This is the final part of the 6-axis robot design tutorial. In the previous video, we have assembled all of our 6-axis robot designs completely. And now it's time for the simulation part. To do simulation, open the DMU kinematics in the CATIA software. In order to stimulate something, we need to consider some stuffs like the constraints in the assembly part should be perfectly aligned. If that didn't constrain correctly, you can make a simulation. The software says, boom, you can stimulate it. So you need to define everything perfectly to get a simulation. So you need to fix a part before you get into the work. Fix a base part, hence it will be a rigid object and does not have any movement. And now comes the type of the joint that we need to consider. There are more types of joints that works dependently for each and every mechanisms. So now we are going to use a revolute joint throughout the whole mechanism. After you click on the revolute joint, a box is popped up. And we need to define the line and the plane of the two parts to make a simulation. Okay, now then proceed the same thing for all the axes. And while performing this kind of work, you can hide the particular part and define the values, which will be more helpful during this process.
and before we get into the simulation we need to assign the angles of the each individual parts of the designs Okay guys this is the simulation part now you can get the simulation by adjusting the angles and you can preview the motion of the six axis robot hope you guys got a wide understanding about the cat designing and so sorry guys i couldn't able to do a voice cover during the making of the designs in the previous videos because this is my first try and i'm learning gradually how to make and do stuffs to get a quality video thanks for supporting guys stay tuned for the next video Until then keep supporting Createch don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel